Hi everyone, welcome back to PBS India YouTube channel. So today we are going to discuss about USFDA Food and Drug Administration guideline. Previously we discussed about what are the part two levels, what is part two level and subparts. So this is session part two. We are going to talk subpart B Organization and Personnel. Twenty one CFR part two eleven subpart B having four sub guidelines. First one is two eleven two two responsibilities of quality control unit, and second one two eleven two five. Personal qualifications. Two eleven two eight. Personal responsibilities. Two eleven three four. Consultants. These are the four sub guidelines covered under Part two eleven sub part B. So we are going to discuss sub part guideline wise. Two eleven two two. Responsibilities of quality control unit. So, pharma pharmaceutical organizations having few departments like production, manufacturing, packing, formulations, quality control, quality assurance, and warehouse like that. So, the guideline two eleven point two two talk about responsibilities of quality control unit. The QC department. There shall be a quality control unit that shall have the responsibility and authority to approve or reject all components, drug product containers, closures, in process materials, packaging material, labeling, and drug products, and the authority to review production records. to assure that no errors have occurred or if errors have occurred that they have been fully investigated the quality control unit shall be responsible for approving or rejecting drug products manufactured processed packed or held under contract by another company the responsibilities of quality control you know having the adequate laboratory facilities for the testing and approval or rejection of components drug product containers closures packaging materials in process materials and drug products shall be available to the quality control unit the responsibility of qc also the quality control unit shall have the responsibility for approving or rejecting all procedures or specifications impacting on the identity strength quality and purity of the drug product the responsibilities and procedures applicable to the quality control unit shall be in written sorry shall be in writing such written procedures shall be followed like sop standard operating procedures standard testing procedures like that then next topic is 2125 personal qualification personal means those who are going to work in pharmaceutical organization each person engaged in the manufacturing processing packing or holding of a drug product shall have education training and experience or any combination thereof to enable that person to perform the assigned functions training shall be in the particular operation that the employee performs and in current good manufacturing practice
including the CGMP regulations in this chapter and written procedures required by these regulations as they related to the employees functions. Training in CGMP shall be conducted by qualified individuals on a continuing basis and with sufficient frequency to assure that employees remain familiar with CGMP requirements applicable to them. Means, usually whenever people join in the pharma, people undergone trainings. After training only, they are doing their responsibilities, assigned jobs. So whenever required, they have to retain the training. Two loan two five P. Each person responsible for supervising the manufacture, processing, packing, or holding of a drug product shall have the education, training, and experience, or any combination thereof. Like we discussed, while doing operations, people usually we do done by and checked by in the documentation process. Checked by means the supervisor. Supervisor means having sufficient education training and experience to perform assigned functions in such a manner as to provide assurance that the drug product has a safety, identity, strength, quality and purity that it purports are represented to possess. There shall be an adequate number of qualified personnel to perform and supervise the manufacture, processing, packing or holding of each drug product means this is a quantity quantity of people required to do and verify then switch to 2128 personal responsibilities personal engaged in the manufacture processing packing or holding of a drug product shall wear clean clothing appropriate for the duties they perform. Protective apparel such as headgear, face, hand and arm coverings shall be worn as a necessary to protect drug products from contamination. Personnel shall practice good sanitization and health habits. Only personnel authorized by supervisory personnel shall enter those areas of the buildings and facilities designated as limited access areas means segregated manner those who are working in production they have to only enter those who are working in the QC or aseptic areas they having the limited access to enter the, all the process areas any person shown at any time either by medical examination or supervisor observation to have an apparent illness or open lesion that may adversely affect the safety or quality of the drug products shall be excluded from the direct contact with components. Drug product containers, closures, in process materials and drug products until the condition is corrected are determined by competent medical personnel not to jeopardize the safety or quality of drug products. All personnel shall be instructed to report to supervisory personnel any health conditions that may have an adverse effect on drug products. Basically, in formulations, when they are entering into aseptic areas, they personally do self-declaration as they are doing good or they are suffering any illness. And 211.34 Consultants Consultants advising on the manufacture, processing, packaging or holding of drug products shall have sufficient education, training and experience or any combination thereof to advise on the subject for which they are retained. Records shall be maintained stating the name, address and qualifications of any consultants and the type of service they provide to pharma organizations. Thank you friends. Our next session topic is part 211 subpart C buildings and facilities. 
so this session going to conduct soon please do subscribe to our channel if you have any questions and answer please express your concerns on this tutorial and post under the comments box we do feel happy if you like this session and please comment thank you thank you for watching this tutorial on part 211 subpart b organization and personal please do subscribe to our channel to learn regular updates thank you